Hi, welcome back. I'm with Ken from Reliable Drain. And um, Ken, I got a question. I live in a house myself that was built in 1954. I have got very old windows, a very old roof, and uh, I don't know how old the pipes in my house are, but I think every stinking one of them has got to be uh, at least a 1954 a vintage pipe. So I guess the question is, how would I know when it's time to replace any of the pipes in my house? Well, anytime you're dealing with an old home like that, an old piping, you you have to pay attention, right? You're gonna have probably some galvanized piping. Over the years, I'm sure some guys have made some mixed piping where they've crossed the uh, copper to plastic to galvanized and all the different metals. One of the biggest problems that we see in the plumbing industry is dissimilar metals. Um, when you connect different types of metals, it creates an electrolysis and that can oh, right. pit and electrolysis, yeah. So electric going through the pipes pits the pipes. Oh, wow. Is that safe? I mean, is that okay? Uh, yeah, it's safe. It's, it's not something that's going to shock you, but it's uh, just that small electrical charge in there actually eats the pipes apart. Okay. Um, so, you know, the, the easiest thing I would say on an old system like that is just pay attention, right? If you see something leaking, if you see something corroding, uh, call somebody and get an opinion before you end up with a, you know, a major catastrophe. If they call you, is that something that, you know, people should always say or a lot, you know, let you know how old their house is, how old their plumbing is? Is that, does that go into your, you know, your, your diagnosis of the problem? Uh, not really, because you can have an old house that has new piping. You can have a new house that has some older piping, you know, depending on who did the job and what type of materials they used. Um, so okay. the biggest thing is just self-inspection, self-awareness. You know, if you see something that doesn't look yeah. right on your drain or your water line, if it looks corroded, looks like it's leaking, uh, it's bent, so it's not put together straight. That's that's really what I would recommend people start looking that's, for. That's great. Well, that's well, I'll tell you, if you own a house like I do that's a little older, or even not, uh, why don't you take a look at your plumbing? Um, Ken mentioned a few things to look for. And if there's anything that you think you're a little suspicious, give Reliable Drain a call. Uh, you can stop by their website right now at ReliableDrain.com. And uh, if you want them to, uh, Ken and his crew to stop in, just give them a call. They'd be happy to take, uh, take care of you. Thanks a lot, Ken. Appreciate the information. Thank you. Have a good day.